vestiges from the grip muscles, right? It goes from the tailbone to the ischial spine. Right? Here, here, right? So I need to palpate it, so I'll just find the tailbone. Come off this way. Be careful, ask lab permission, guys, right? And then you have to what? How do I shorten this? By adducting, moving this, this way. So the lower half has to what? Adduct. The top half has to abduct. So you're doing this. Remember, the muscle goes from here to here. So imagine that muscle. It's my thumb. You're doing this. To shorten it, and then you're doing this to lengthen it. Okay? So in Jenny's case here, right? Once again, why am I doing this? Out of muscular and My muscular end feel or was hypertonic and I think it's causing unphysiological rotator sacrum. Okay? So once again, bend here, find the tailbone, come off laterally, right? And that's your issue exigious, it's, it's a little bit tight, not too bad. Okay? So for me to adduct this, my whole hand pushes that way, right? Okay? My thenoid eminence is doing this. Okay? So I'm going to this side here. Drop, drop down, I'm doing this. Okay? Obviously, if you have a smaller hand, the part is bigger, you can't do as much, but you're still doing this compression force. Then your other hand is on the ASI, is doing abduction. So abduction here, adduction. And that is shortening the extra exigious. Okay? And then you do your release of the word, just breathe in for me. And let my fingers sink in deeper, this side, the hypotonic side, right? Alright, very good, okay. Is that better? Okay? And then to stretch it, what do you do? You just do the opposite. Okay? HEP, you teach a pa patient how to do this with a, t with a tennis ball. Or a, uh, a rack of ball right next to the tailbone. So what, you put the ball under their tailbone and then would they just Not push under, next, to the next to it, but then they would just take their, all they would have to do then is take their top hand and push this no. away. No, they just rest it. Oh, the just, okay, because it, it should disappear. Okay, so practice your SI mobility testing and practice your issue of